Ojepa is a supportive community in Hawke's Bay which celebrates the diverse ways of being human. Our work focuses on supporting people with intellectual disabilities to live a great life. My favourite part is this, uh, bring the cows up slowly. We don't force them up. No, I just love my cows, eh? We've got three cows just been born this day before yesterday. Uh, two peppers down there, two little ones, two white ones. People buy them off us. No, I'm loving it. No, it's good. Loving it. Our vision is every life fully lived. We are very values based. Morning, Ethan. How are you? You well? Yeah. And uh, we take great pride in celebrating the value of Fakamana, community, and sustainability. My name is Santiago de Marco. I'm the general manager at Jojepa. I'm a farmer. What are you called? Yeah, the yogurt's made here as well. I love my yogurt, eh? Because yogurt's good for you. If you don't eat your yogurt, you don't get nowhere. You can have your porridge, because it's good energy for yourself too. We support 180 people across our services, and we employ 150 staff. It's about being diverse, being inclusive and celebrating the uniqueness of every individual that has something to offer. For us, engaging, participating and contributing is such a key foundation in the work that we do. We have 55 acres of grazing area. We milk a small number of cows, around 50. Uh, we supply our own cheese factory. So our own in-house residents work both in the farm and in the cheesery. My name is Carl Storey. I work at Hohepa Homes in the Hawke's Bay and I run the farm and cheesery as the manager here. All of our people that we support have particular needs and interests. The jobs are tailored for them. It's not jobs we've created just to fill in their time. So it's a real community at Hohepa. So we get to do the whole cycle literally from paddock to plate. We just tailor the work to their skill level. It's all about for us for about sustainability, so our bottles are totally reusable, not just recyclable. Hi Oliver. Hi. Can I have another milk for that please? Pretty neat. And I'll go and do some shopping there. And we're also now just launching home compostable packaging. So literally when you buy the cheese from Ho Hepa, it'll come in which looks like plastic, but it's actually a starch product, and it's completely home compostable. So that's the innovation side of it. So we're Big enough to be commercial, but small enough to be innovative. They're just delicious. This is my only parsley I've got in my garden at the moment, but that's all good. Yeah, it's all nice and green. That looks really cool. Yeah, I like it. Paul, you want to get in here on the kale picking? Harvesting three times a week and uh, involving as many people as possible. Because when I first came to Hohepa back in, in the, um, not centuries ago, but back in, back when I was little, about seven, I, um, I wanted to do gardening. You've been such a, like a, a farm dad to all of us. Tessie, yes, you're very welcome. Let's keep up the good work, shall we? Yes, we will. Okay. Mm. We've got a quadruple bottom line approach where we take into consideration the financial uh, perspective, the cultural perspective, the social perspective and the environmental perspective. From a business point of view, we take great uh, care that we don't only make decisions that are commercially sensitive. We need to run a business that it needs to be commercially viable, but mainly we are here for delivering on our vision of every life fully lived.